Laddie Boy was the first real White House celebrity dog. He had his own White House portrait, an Airedale Terrier with his own chair in the cabinet room. He went everywhere with President Harding, and the nation loved it. The stuffed animal we have here was the first time a White House pet was, was used as a model for a child's toy, so that's Laddie. So if you were a kid in the early 20s, that's what you wanted was a stuffed Laddie boy. What's missing today from the Laddie boy display at the Harding home is a special leather and gold dog collar given to President Harding by the people of Alaska during a visit to the Alaskan territories in 1923, shortly before he died. Police found a ladder and a pry bar at the scene where a burglar jimmied an upstairs window and snatched the dog collar. A jewelry box was damaged but left behind. Staff members were shaken by the theft. After having worked here for 16 years, and I feel as if I knew the Hardings, and it's a, it's a feeling of violation that someone would do such a thing. I really don't know what to make of it. It's, it's something that's never happened here before. And it's something uh, we take extremely seriously. The collar helped tell the story here of a president and his love for a dog. So the theft leaves an empty spot in the display and a hole in the story. The hope is that by spreading the word quickly, that pawnbrokers and gold dealers might then recognize the item if somebody were to bring it in. Or that the thief for thieves might have a change of heart and simply return it. In Marion, Ted Hart, NBC4.